Hey, it's Susie Essman, and you're watching Comedy Matters TV. And please subscribe. Subscribe. So I'm here on the red carpet at the Gold Coast Film Festival with the star of the evening, Susie Essman. How are you, babe? This is all your fault. I know. It is, right? <laughs> I know. It's completely my fault. I know. It's ridiculous, right? No, it's fun. Yeah, it's fun, though. So look at these good. people. People, people nice. went crazy when they heard you were coming. Look at this. 300 Long Jews. Island. Long Island, Jeffrey. It's my people. people. And let's plug my gig at Governor's while we're yeah, here. Let's do that. Tell us about it. When are you going to be at Governor's? Uh, Governor's in Levittown, November. Whatever that Friday, Saturday. 8, 9 or 7, 8. Whatever the Friday, Saturday is in November. November 8, 9, I think. But go to the website and look it up. Tell me, uh, yes, make sure you go. Tell me about London. London must have been amazing. Oh, London was amazing. Su Susie just did eight sold out shows in London at the Soho Theatre. Yeah, right? yeah, it Is was it first amazing. Time in London? No, I've been there before, but this was the first time that I did such a long run. And uh, I, it was just, th there's so, such a great audience, and London is such a happening city right now. I've been going there for years, and it's, it's like really buzzing, you know? It's a really energized place right now. It's fun. And did they get all the jokes because of the language? <laughs> yes, they know what the they language, the language is. is. I'll tell you they one thing, though. Yeah. Don't say anything about the Queen. I made a joke about the Queen. Oh, really? oh yeah. do not say anything about the Queen. They're very sensitive you about You could the say queen. anything about Camilla or Charles or Harry or, you know, whatever. Nothing about the Queen. And I wouldn't even go near Diana. So how did you find that out? Did you say something about the yes. Queen? And what did they say to you? I just felt the room go quiet. Really? And I was like, okay, I can't say anything about the Queen, and then I moved on. Oh, you mentioned it out loud. You said it out loud, yeah. And you did that every night for eight nights? No, after the second night, I realized, I mean, Jimmy, my husband said to me, you realize that a hush is coming over the room when you say something about the Queen. It's like, yeah, I noticed that. So then I thought, all right, I'll cut out the bit about the Queen. I'm not dummy. Exactly. So who's with you tonight? Uh, Jimmy's here, and uh, uh, which of the kids? You have four uh, kids, right? Yeah, Kyle and Juliana, my two daughters. My daughter Kyle's my makeup artist. Did a great job, yes. by the way. Love very the curls. Talented. We're very talented. And uh, Kyle's, uh, Juliana's boyfriend, James, who lives on Long Island. And like that. Cool. And your daughters are here. My daughters are here. How fun is that, oh right? Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> we'll introduce our daughters. To who ever thought that we would have daughters, right? It's amazing, right? Life goes on. Life is very strange, yeah. yeah. So I heard that Larry David sent you a message recently that he missed you, huh? Oh, now Larry calls me all the time and tells me he misses me. Yeah. And then you said to him, then let's do a ninth season. I said it to myself. Okay. To myself I said it, but he doesn't seem to want to do a ninth season. He's got I a lot going him. on, right? You know what? It's up to him. Larry, I love Larry more than anybody in the whole world except for Jimmy, my husband. And if he wants to do another season, I'm there. If he doesn't, Zyka Zunterhag, it's been a great... It's, it's been, been a great run. Eight, you've been on since the beginning. Yeah, eight seasons. And, you know, I mean, I could do it into my old age. I could do Curb because I'm not going to grow out of the part. Um, but it's so you. Yeah. It's, he might change his mind. Who knows? I never know with him. He's very mercurial. That's a good word for him, yeah. mercurial. Yeah. Yeah, it's like people, when they're poor, they're crazy. When they're rich, they're eccentric. Right. He's mercurial. He's mercurial. He's somebody, you know, and I, I read people really well, but he's somebody that I could never tell you what he's going to do. Absolutely. Well, I think that's part of his genius. Yeah. Well, he is that a he genius. Does, he does whatever he wants. And he, and he is a genius. And I, I don't bant that word around, throw that word around. He's a genius. There were so many stories. Uh, even in my book, which you're in, the Make Him Laugh book, that we're doing this Saturday, we're doing an event. Susie's in both of the, uh, the projects, the film, the, the business of comedy. and in my here book, yet? It's airing this coming Saturday. Okay, cool. Yeah, cool. Saturday night from 5 to 7. They had to glue the mic in the mic stand because Larry da at the, uh, the comic strip because Larry David kept throwing it on the floor and breaking the mic. So they glued the mic into the stand. <laughs> Yeah, well, he's a wild guy. Yeah, he's mercurial. And a genius. Yeah, an absolute yeah. genius. So tonight is going to be fun. I'm introducing you. I still don't know what I'm doing. You don't I have to know. decided yet, but I'll you figure it out. It. You introduce me. I know you got a clip with some special guests. I'm eager to see what that is, and then I'll get up and I'll say something, and then we'll figure it out from we'll there. We'll figure it. We'll just wing it. That's all. And then we'll do a Q and A with the audience, and it'll be wonderful. Okay. So good to see you. And I won't mess up your makeup. It's great.